Welcome to the demo of the sheet layout tool in the guardrail layout application. First we're going to select the drawing scale. In this case we're using 20. Then we're going to select the northing and easting. We're going to select the button. We're going to tentative and data point at that location. We want to select a point that's just outside of where our guardrail pad ends. We're going to do that at both the farthest east and farthest west locations that we can get. Here I'm showing you that it's picked up those microstation coordinates. Now we're going to select the layout shape button. It's laid out a clip shape. And here we're selecting the bottom one. Next we select the draw sheet button and now it's giving you a chance to save the file where you would like to put it. That's going through and clipping and generating your file. In this file you have four reference files. The top reference file is referenced twice, the bottom is referenced twice. The top one is a global aligned file, the bottom is just moved and set in the sheet. The top file, the top number slot number one, is set to have a line style scale matching a reference file. The second slot number two is set to match the master file. The master file is set to the scale of your model. So if you selected a 20 scale, your line styles will scale to a 0.2. A 50 scale will be a set to a model scale of a 0.5. Same thing in your 3 and 4 models. Here I'm showing you the global line style scales. This is done so the drawing appears to be proper with your line style scales. I'm showing you that the models are all set to uh, the levels are displayed off so the file looks proper.